Have you ever felt out of breath after climbing just one flight of stairs and wondered if there's something you could do to breathe easier? Believe it or not, shedding a few pounds might be part of the solution. Losing weight can have a noticeable impact on how well your body takes in and uses oxygen. And that's great news for anyone looking to boost their energy levels and overall well-being. In this video, we'll explore exactly why losing weight can help improve your oxygen levels, what happens to your lungs and airways when you carry extra pounds, and how you can start breathing a little easier by making healthy changes to your lifestyle. Losing weight can have a significant positive impact on oxygen levels in the body, particularly for individuals who are overweight or obese. Excess body weight, especially when concentrated in the abdominal region, can place increased pressure on the diaphragm and lungs, making it more difficult to take deep breaths. This restriction can lead to reduced lung expansion and lower oxygen intake with each breath. As a result, the body may struggle to maintain adequate oxygenation, leading to shortness of breath and fatigue. Additionally, excess fat tissue can contribute to inflammation throughout the body, including in the lungs and airways. Inflammatory processes can lead to the narrowing of the airways, reducing airflow and making it harder for oxygen to reach the bloodstream efficiently. By losing weight, individuals may experience a decrease in systemic inflammation, improving lung function, and making breathing easier. This can be particularly beneficial for individuals with conditions such as asthma, COPD, or obstructive sleep apnea, where excess weight exacerbates respiratory symptoms. Obstructive sleep apnea, a common condition in overweight individuals, is directly linked to oxygen deprivation during sleep. Fat deposits around the neck and airway can obstruct breathing, leading to repeated episodes of low oxygen levels known as hypoxia. Weight loss can significantly reduce the severity of sleep apnea by decreasing the amount of fatty tissue pressing on the airway. As a result, individuals who lose weight often experience improved oxygen saturation during sleep, leading to better rest, increased energy levels, and improved overall health. Furthermore, weight loss can enhance cardiovascular health, which in turn supports better oxygen transport throughout the body. Obesity is often associated with reduced cardiovascular efficiency, meaning that the heart must work harder to pump oxygen-rich blood to tissues and organs. Losing weight can improve heart function by reducing strain on the cardiovascular system, increasing circulation, and optimizing oxygen delivery. This improvement can lead to better endurance, increased physical activity levels, and a reduced risk of conditions such as heart disease and hypertension. For individuals with obesity-related respiratory issues, even modest weight loss can lead to noticeable improvements in oxygen levels and overall well-being. Studies have shown that losing as little as 5-10% to of body weight can lead to significant improvements in lung function, respiratory mechanics, and oxygenation. By adopting a healthy diet and regular physical activity, individuals can promote weight loss while also strengthening respiratory muscles, further supporting efficient breathing and oxygen exchange. But as you can see, losing weight can help improve oxygen levels by enhancing lung function, reducing inflammation, alleviating pressure on the diaphragm, and improving cardiovascular health. Individuals who achieve a healthier weight often experience better breathing, increased energy, and improved overall quality of life. For those with conditions such as COPD or sleep apnea, weight loss can be particularly beneficial in preventing complications and enhancing oxygenation, making it a crucial step toward better respiratory and cardiovascular health. But real quick, if you don't mind, please drop a like on this video and subscribe to support the channel. And there should be some other helpful videos popping up on your screen right about now that I think you will enjoy. And just a quick reminder, we are not doctors. This video is for informational purposes only. Have a nice day and thanks for watching.